Have you ever gazed up at the night sky and wondered what extraordinary journeys are unfolding among the stars? Today, we dive into a tale of innovation, ambition, and the boundless reaches of space. In the quiet pre-dawn hours of January 8, 2024, a powerful force stirred at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station. The United Launch Alliance's Vulcan Centaur rocket, a marvel of engineering and determination, awaited its inaugural mission, poised to mark history. At 2.18 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, the Vulcan rocket roared to life, carrying the Peregrine commercial robotic lunar lander on its back. This wasn't just a routine launch. It was a pivotal moment for United Launch Alliance, whose destiny hinged on the success of this mission. For ULA, this mission wasn't just about launching a payload into space. It was a bold step towards returning the United States to the moon, a feat not achieved since 1972. The Peregrine Lunar Lander, a creation of Astrobotic, held the hopes of a nation, carrying experiments, scientific instruments, and tech demos for NASA and other clients. As the rocket ascended into the celestial expanse, ULA's president and CEO, Tori Bruno, couldn't contain his excitement. Yeehaw! I'm so thrilled, I can't tell you how much, he exclaimed, expressing the collective sentiment of a dedicated team that had worked tirelessly for this moment. Minutes after the Peregrine lander separated from the rocket's upper stage, Astrobotics team received telemetry data, confirming that the mission was on the right trajectory. Astrobotics CEO John Thornton spoke of big milestones, bringing humanity one step closer to a lunar rendezvous. Meanwhile, NASA Administrator Bill Nelson hailed the mission's significance, emphasizing the collaboration with the private sector through the Commercial Lunar Payload Services Program. The moon, once again, became a stage for scientific exploration and a testament to American technology and innovation. With 20 payloads aboard, including five from NASA, the Peregrine lander is now en route to its historic landing attempt on February 23. The anticipation is palpable as we eagerly await the outcome of this mission, a blend of scientific exploration and commercial space enterprise. In a flawless countdown that spanned 10 hours, the Vulcan rocket etched its name in history. Powered by a combination of methane and liquid oxygen, it became the first U.S. rocket to successfully reach orbital velocity using this propellant mix. ULA's Vulcan, born from years of dedication and innovation, stands as a beacon of our nation's space capability and mission flexibility. And so, as we look to the stars and ponder the limitless possibilities that lie beyond, we witness the triumphant ascent of ULA's Vulcan rocket, paving the way for future explorations into the cosmos. With that said, thanks for watching, and until next time, keep looking up.